The battle to make the final grade for the team that will tour the North American island of Barbados continues to intensify day by day. The she cranes will depart for Barbados on February 21st, where they will play a build-up match as they prepare for the 2018 Commonwealth Games. Officials believe the presidential pledge to reward the players with 20 million shillings each in case of a Commonwealth gold medal proves to be a huge motivational factor. The president promised them that any gold medal is 20 million. So it is very active and we are seeing very, very positive and we are seeing very girls doing their best to make sure they qualify to go and play and qualify and get the medals. Before departing for Barbados, the Sheik Cranes will play a series of build-up games in Narua and Lida. This after they returned from another successful trip in Masaka and in Barala last weekend. We decided to go on what we call netball back home, where we want to tour the whole of Uganda to at least take netball back to the grassroots so that we try to see if we can tap, the, we can tap talent from right from the grassroots. And that's actually our motive of moving around Uganda and netball back home. We started our, train, our tour from western Uganda, actually Uganda region, that is the Great Massacre, where we played in Massacre on Saturday. And then on Sunday, we went to Mbarara, where we played in Barara, and we are back. This is trading so that on tenth we shall be traveling to the northern direction to go and play in the Arua as well as Lira. The team has been boosted in training by the presence of six members that took part in the 2016 World Cup. They are joined by three youngsters that participated in last year's Youth World Cup in Botswana. Sam Poza, NTV Sport.